probably have to get every single memory thing, don't I? Oh my gosh. I think I missed some on some planets. Dang it! Because I was, I thought it was kind of weird that my dad didn't say anything about the benefactor being super mysterious and blah blah blah, you know? Havaral science team deployment. The Nexus has approved the request for a multidisciplinary team to be posted on Havaral to assist with the Angaran efforts there. Blah, blah, blah. Both Angaran and Nexus teams have expressed, interesting, have expressed interest in having the Pathfinder visit Havaral again to observe the cross-cultural efforts. Okay. So that's how I'll maybe get more points from Liam. Proud of Havaral. I mean, sure, living there would have been fun. That planet is one pterodactyl away from Jurassic Funfair, but what we did for the Angara will go a long way to making us good neighbors. We need that, especially with the scourge restricting the neighborhood. Security is training up on what the locals know about local faunas. Outpost or not, Havaral helps. Liam has included a list of media themed to community. Genres include century-old situation comedies and documentaries about research partnerships. Also a musical about a man-eating plant. Okay. Yay! Whatever Sufis could give me the galley smells terrible. She says it's for movie night. Good cause. Good cause. Bad for the snacks. I can do better. Come see me and I'll show you. Oh, okay. Contact director you Addison from, Hav from Havaro. Okay. And I can go... Wait, no, 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 no. no. Cancel. Cancel. No. She's probably upstairs. Unless she's in her room, actually. Which is possible. Gilvetra. Oh yeah, no, she's in there. Okay. I don't know why that's still. I didn't. I didn't tell it to search to to click on the family writer secret things. Vetra. Snacks. Suvi. Gotta love her, but <laughs> this green snack thing she's making for Liam's movie night? Let's just say they're probably better suited to throwing at the screen. You've got a better idea? Yeah, actually. Cora lent me an initiative access code so I could track down some contraband. Oh, Long boy! Story short, someone on Kadara <gasps> popcorn. And Grexen, which is like your popcorn, only better because I can eat it. Ah, uh, because I can eat it. <laughs> popcorn? Someone what? smuggled popcorn across galaxies. It's light, and people would pay big credits for it. Why not? Fair enough. I could track some down the next time we're there. Thanks. It would be nice to have a treat out here, you know? That is so funny. I think there's a couple reasons that we need to go to Kadara now. And, wait, wait, wait. Was there something else in here? Oop, nope. God dang. Okay. Remnant ruins on Kadara. That's right. Okay. Okay, I forgot. I completely forgot we were doing PB's mission also. Kadara it is. I check in on... I probably will check in on Reyes anyway, but I don't think anything's going to change. In fact, I probably won't. Yeah, I'll change the battery soon. Kadada. I don't know, I probably will, but I don't know. Probably nothing will change until I further the main mission. Like, I remember back in the day, they were saying that they were going to make it more organic and less checkpointy for relationships, but there's really not much way you can, many ways to change it, you know? Like, certain things can only be discussed after certain events have happened, you know? I think I was supposed to talk to, what's his bucket too, the, the doc guy? Or maybe I already did that. I think I already did that. No, yeah, that was tracking down the Yetta. I can't believe I remember that. Alright, and we need to go... well... 
Where is popcorn? Popcorn? Yeah, popcorn. Hey, you. Get back. I should be able to get um my contact should be able to help me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Raze, just give me some popcorn, please. I know you know where it is. Hi. Is it like the mods merchant? Don't mind the dirt. Um. I don't think the mod guy is going to give me snacks. Unless there's something directly below me. Got something I think you'll love. There we go. Maybe. Snacks! No. We did it! Popcorn sounds much better than some random native plant. I did a fried yucca the other day. That was cool. It was in a Brazilian restaurant. It was quite good. It tasted like french fries. Like a little bit sweeter french fries. I pass yucca all the time in the desert. It's a pretty plant. It's one of my favorite desert plants. I wasn't really aware you could eat it. I mean, it makes sense. Obviously. But. I just didn't know. I didn't know. Who do we have? PB and Joel, yeah, sure. Joel's interesting to bring around just to hear his, you know, his Angaran perspective if, if we get a chance to ever hear him. That's right, I'm not using my biotics right now, I'm using my text. Let's actually switch that. Please, let me switch it. Yes. Hmm. It's like not letting me press the button, like I'm pressing it, it's not doing anything. Oh wait, what? Where does she want me to go on Kadara? Oh, that's okay, movie night. I was like, what? I don't understand. Where am I? No. Um I was, yay, verily confused. There we go. Odd. Well, let's see if we can fast travel. Meow. Man, it's not really close to it. Oh, it's close to the outpost, I guess. Well, this is actually faster. We'll just go northeast from there. Oh, man. Kadar is beautiful. Give me back my nomad, please. People have been fighting the cat for a long time. Since long before my birth. Are you encouraged that you have allies now? Us, I mean. <laughs> it's better not to die alone. Yes. Wow. <laughs> you don't think we can win? This isn't a typical war. Therefore, winning won't be typical. What is a typical war? I mean, you know? 
scary. Oh yeah, there's uh, people who are Looks like... Looks like outlaws are camping this site. People who are like, for some reason, competing with us? Talking from. All right, let's find the piece of tech PB needs. Checking this container. Oh. Maverick Deadeye armor. Hmm. Huh. Interesting. Empty? Oh. There's a data pad. Looks like there's a message for us. <laughs> Hope my boys put up a fight. But you're too slow, Pathfinder. I got what you're looking for. I'll meet you and you're a sorry in Kadara Port. You can buy the tech from me. Out. We need that or I could just call Reyes. Guess we've got a date with an annoying outlaw who fancies himself a rival. Why can't I use my Reyes contacts? I suppose you could say that's abusing the system when the Pathfinder knows the the whatever the what does he call himself? I can't even remember what he calls himself. But yeah. Oh yeah, seriously though. I had to get my popcorn myself. I'm gonna have to talk to this outlaw myself. It would be helpful if you could do some work for once. I mean, I do a lot as a thing, and maybe it's abusing power, but uh, I don't care. I was hoping you'd stop by. The charlatan, that's right. I better get going. Thanks for stopping by. Well, and this being such an open world game, like, the romances just seem like, I mean, once you get to the point, like, you know, once you get your romance or whatever locked in, there's like nothing else to do. It's like, really, really empty. Like, I mean, it, it, it could be kind of frustrating in the Mass Effect trilogy, but at least you knew, like, you know, it only, you, you could spend a certain amount of time on side quests and stuff, but all of it was like, Simple and straightforward and to the point you go to one planet and you're done, you know, type thing and I don't know You could make you take as much time between missions as you wanted, but No, I'm just, uh, oh, there we go. It, like, seemed to be on the stairs somewhere. I was like, what is going on? One tire nation? 
All oh, right, we're gonna go. Hey, gotta go grab back PB off. First. What I got, you can't afford. <laughs> Waiting for that Krogan to show. Just need to buy the Remtech piece off him so I can perfect my remnant scanner. He and his crew keep showing up at sites we're targeting. It can't be coincidence. I think they could be following us somehow. That makes sense. It would be nice to know for sure. I'm working on it. Ryder, come in. We've got a problem. Oh? Go ahead, Callow. We've had an intruder. Got on board and into Peepee's quarters. From oh! On. Pock? How the hell did that happen? Not sure. Someone knew what they were doing. They left an impressive piece of rem tech and a recorded message, relaying it now. Oh! Uh, it's Kalinda Terev. Pelisari is... well... whatever she calls me these days. Please tell her thank you for the nifty bot. I trust the rem tech piece my crew took will be adequate payment. Oh, and no need to wait for my Krogan friend, Kranit. He and his outlaws work for me. <sighs> oh, snap! Shit! Why can't she just leave me alone? Why does she have it in for you, PB? She shouldn't. I'm the offended party. Ugh. To complete my scanner, I need access to the storage device in Pock. Kalinda's always been a troublemaker. Anything for a rise. And if there's a profit in it, all the better. I'm sorry you're catching her crap now, Ryder. You don't have to deal with this. I'll take care of it on my own, I promise. Hey, we're in this together. They got under my uh, ship! Like, how in the thanks. world did that happen? When I have a lead on getting Pock back, I'll let like, you, know. you can't just- you can't just say that! You stole my bot. Like, the only time anybody ever stole the Normandy was when... Was when my clone got on there. You know what I mean? Like... Like, we're gonna need a- they- someone knew what they were doing. What do you mean? They had, like, the access codes to get in? There were no- nobody was watching? The videos? Nobody- Cora wasn't on- nobody was on watch? Like, what the heck? Hands off. Those are mine. I guess from what I can tell, at least the Normandy had, like, a crew that, like, ran her. But the Tempest does not have a crew, really, that runs her. Like, apparently she just runs herself, and, like, Gil does all the maintenance, and, like, freaking Callow drives. Like, that's a little bit odd. Uh, I just I just wish they'd have focused on making things more cohesive instead of just like here have an open world. I'm like we haven't wanted an open world this big for like five years, like a lot of people prefer like that like it, the linear storytelling is like going down the drain for some reason like for some reason they think nobody wants right that here. hi pb you better freaking give me something brighter hey Kala was right nothing missing except talk hate imagining Kalinda tiptoeing around here with nosy eyes and sticky fingers. <sighs> Is there anything you need? Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again So later. they didn't hear her. You know Where it. were Kalo, Kalo and Suzy? Suzy, 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 like, they just, they didn't hear an Asari, like, sneak through here? What the heck? What the heck? Alright, apparently I may need to further the regular mission or something oh wait where's nah. journal 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 oh okay okay um meet with Rayalis on Vold. Well, I need to go to Vold anyway, I guess. Okay. Um know your enemy. 
It looks like, though, I don't even have to do the know your enemy thing. I could just, like, go straight to the end. I think I could go straight to the meridian right now. Ah! Dropping my controller. Also, I'm sad because I want to play Transistor while I'm at the hotel. But... The music is beautiful. Beginning approach. And... I can't use headphones. <laughs> like, I want to be able to hear it. They don't even have, like, an audio, like, an audio jack. Like, in that, on that TV. It was the weirdest thing. I realized, the last, like, almost three hours, I'd just been playing in one session, so I realized I just jumped back to something that I talked to in the first, like, ten minutes. But, Hey! What kind of sniper rifles do I have? The Vanquisher looks cool. I have two, I guess. Um, mm -hmm. I can't destroy that one. What was that one? Pathfinder Observer. It does less damage. It's supposed to weigh less. Oh. What? Okay. I'm confused. Uh, just, uh, ooh. Well, no, the weight one, let's actually not do that one, maybe. Sure. I might do the... Uh, yeah, the damage would be nice. Okay. Cool. Oh. Oh, I have PB and Jaw, uh, right? The LZ. Oh, man. Such a good shot. Such a good shot of my ship. fast travel. Hmm? Oh. Was Realis one of the scouts I talked to before? Or was Realis just happened to be located near a fast travel station? Because this, this game does not make things easy ever. Actually, not as close to the thing as I was led to believe. Wow, I wonder how it works. Do you think they're adapted remnant tech? You don't win a war without good organization. From this room, we keep track of our brothers and sisters in the field. Hmm, okay. Rylas? That's me. Rylis. Yes. I'm Rylis. Well, you really showed up. You said you had intel. I can't ignore that. I just didn't think you'd come yourself. Anyway, I should get to the point. I wish I had the chance to uh, raid on the exaltation send out facility. people. Sent the Kets scrambling. They're trying to get their operations in order. Our scouts report increased Ket movement through certain areas of Vold. Not military, though. Science and research vessels. So, something that could involve exaltation, or the creation of a new exaltation lab. Well, that's what I thought. Either way, Ket organizing means trouble. We don't have the tech to break into their bases, but someone has to stop them. I'll investigate this if I can. That's all I can ask. Thank you, Ryder. I'll send the nav point immediately. 
Okay. Hmm. Okay. They all say the same thing. The resistance is missing supplies. PB, can I can we can we talk yet? Maybe if I go back to the ship. What exactly am I supposed to be scanning? Okay. Mm. What? It's just right down here? What? Yeah, yeah. I joined. Don't get smug about it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She was on Kanara. <laughs> Why are you in bold? Eee. Holy buckets. I don't want to go through a cat facility fight that I have to drive. I don't have that. Oh my gosh, I don't have it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Do we even have, um... Do we have, uh, monoliths marked? Cave. Oh, here's one, I guess. Haven't activated any of the monoliths yet on Vold. Eh, I already did Bavarl. I don't want to do Vold. Um. Let's actually see if I can. Now that I've done that, maybe I can go back to the ship and PB will say, hey, what's up? And I'll be like, it's about freaking time. This is kind of how you had to work the, um... Oh, uh, Citadel DLC from Mass Effect 3. So you could get interactions with each companion. Like, old and new companions. Yes. Rider. Rider. Describe something, someone who can help us find Pock. He might need a little convincing. We go to Kadar Bort. Meet me in the bar, please. Okie dokie, Smokey. We're going back to Kadara. Cool, cool. Back to Kadara. There it is. Friggin' Rez. Rez, why aren't, why aren't you helping, Rez? He's like, oh, we can mutually help each other. Mutually beneficial relationship. Well, so far, I'm the one who's done all the work. Like, yeah, you got your, you got your little, you're in control of Kadara Port now, and that's really freaking nice, but, you did a lot of work to get there, but, you couldn't have done it. Well, you probably could have done it without me, but I made it easier, and I, since then, I have done everything else, and I helped set up that whole scenario with, like, the row car and everything, like, framing them, or whatever it was, I don't even know. I don't know. I don't know. I wonder what I wonder what know your enemy will do. Like I thought, I kind of thought that, that thought that was the main one, but it's not. I think I can go straight to Meridian right now. I'm pretty sure that's what we did. We discovered we could do that. And what, what's the point of know your enemy if you don't, if, if you you know go to if you already go? You know what I mean? Like if you're like I went to Meridian, yay, and then. You still have the Know Your Enemy quest. It's like, what? I already defeated them. Hopefully. Hopefully there's some sort of payoff at the end where you feel like you've actually done something. Oh, we're going to the Reyes bar. Cool beans. Should I bring Vetra? Yeah, let's bring Vetra. She knows all about the shady business. The business of being shady. Come on, invisible wall, let me out.
Wait. Oh my gosh. What? I don't understand. It said to take- oh wait, was that- oh, I- that's right, I messed it up. I messed it up. I still had the know your enemy on, and it was like, go back! It wasn't saying go down to the slums, it was saying, go back to the Tempest, you're doing it wrong. We should be meeting in the shady bar, though, that'd be funnier. I mean, all the bars are shady on Kadarport, but... Doors take forever to open in Kadara. Hey, Drac, you, uh, yeah. You gonna back us up? Liam, will you also back us up? Yeah, it's a bummer when you're not the top of the food chain, huh? It's like, oh, keep the humans. Humans won't get mugged. Now you're just like everybody else. You are my new best friend. Ah, Ryder. I'd like to introduce you to my new best friend. What's your name again? Samrick. Right, right. Samrick here has been so sympathetic about Pock being stolen. He used to run with our pal Kalinda, and he knows where her crews congregate. Safe houses, rallying points, etc. I trust he's telling you what you need to know. Well... Look, uh, I appreciate the drinks and the flattery and all, but... Kalinda doesn't take kindly to people discussing her business interests. She busted me up pretty bad when she kicked me out of her outfit. I don't really want to repeat. You're sitting in an open bar on Kadara Port with us. Kalinda will know, and she'll assume the worst. Yeah, and she probably won't be satisfied the first 30 or 40 times you scream your innocence. So <laughs> you might as well tell us what we want to know. At least that way you get another free drink. Well, <laughs> shit. Guess I can't argue with that. And I am thirsty. <laughs> Thanks, Ryder. I think he'll cooperate now. I'll know where to look for Pop soon. Apparently we're going to Elodin. How about that, Drag? How about that? I agree. <laughs> they can't water him down. That's true. Probably the same thing on e, uh, no. Elodin. Eh, Elodin. I just feel like this is the weirdest way to go about things. Is to be like traveling all over the place and then... And then I have to go all the way back. Like, it's just so convoluted. So convoluted, I don't understand. And like, how many loading screens do I have to go through to finish this one mission? I mean, if they want to, like, you know, make it feel realistic, like, you know, PB had the time to find a contact or whatever you know i get that it's fine but if you just want to finish a mission it's aggravating <laughs> i play video games so i can like welcome back you know you'll be given a list of things to do and then complete them and checking them off is a great boost to my self-confidence or something but when I have to jump all the way across the galaxy it's ridiculous at least I'm playing for a long time today though at least I was kind of thinking I was gonna be done sooner than this but I've got a little bit of time so might as well play as long as I can and then just edit this stuff and whatnot while I'm out 
Maybe that'll be good. We're on course. Indeed, yo. Maybe Drac? Yeah, let's bring Drac. Jarl, though, seems to be the one with Pathfinder. the actual, like... Could support an initiative. Oh. What? You already have an outpost on Elodin. That was a w and it didn't even show the... subtitles, that's weird. Must have been a glitch. Birdies! The most slowest birdies you have ever seen. Oh, wait, wait, though. That's new, though. There weren't birds before, right? Oh, and we land next to the Krogan colony. That's cool. Where yet? Where yet? Where yet? Oh my gosh, Elodin's huge. Holy crap! Can I just fast? I haven't gotten that yet, and I've been like right there. Are you serious? What the heck? I haven't gotten that one, and I've been over there. That doesn't make any sense, though. Oh my gosh, this is the worst. This is the worst. Like, that area should be kind of grayish if I haven't been close enough to snatch it. Snatch it. Mm, let's see. Oh, of course, of course, of course, of course. I had to go east, south, and then west. Yeah. survived by yourself, I survived by myself. What's the big hairy deal? We're standing on a lot of bones, know it or not. Got them all. I think we've heard that one already, but I appreciate it. Might have done all the PB and drag stuff, I guess. Okay, yep, we gotta go east. Southwest. Okay. I like the variety of the planets. Pillars, let's check them no, out. it's not. Get ready to fight. No. Let's see, is this? Yes. This is where you turn south. Pathfinder, someone is attempting to access your comm unit. Should I what? pass it Go ahead. Hello, you're a Pathfinder, right? I recognize your receiver ID. I need help. I'm in the sinkhole. It's the one with... I'm sure you'll figure it out. What? How did you get a shuttle stuck in the sinkhole? I shouldn't be in here. I guess in the worst case, we can get out of push. <laughs> oh, good. You heard me. I was starting to think I'd have to walk back to that rundown shack they call a landing zone. What are you doing out here? I'm a scientist from the Nexus. I've been surveying Elodin's geography for several weeks now. And now I'm stranded on this hellhole. I take it your shuttle broke down? Well, yes and no. A few days ago, my shuttle overheated and died. Then I ran out of water. After two days without a drop, I got desperate. Ended up trading a part from my ship to some scavengers. Once the delirium subsided, I realized my mistake. 
Turns out I sold them my thruster, which you need to fly. The Tempest can get you back to the Nexus in no time. And leave my ship here to be picked apart. If I leave, that shuttle needs to come with me. I figure since you're a Pathfinder, maybe you can talk to the scavengers. Get that part oh. back. If I have time, I'll see what I can do. Fair enough. I'll try not to die of exposure in the meantime. I'll give you I the gave you an easy option. Camp. Be ready. They're a prickly bunch. Have you learned anything useful about Elodin? That depends on what you consider useful. Try me. Well, I assume you know Elodin receives constant sunlight. There is no night time. But I've found evidence of a rare temperature dip, which means the planet experiences an occasional eclipse. Can you imagine? Constant blazing sun for years, then a week of night. It must be jarring. Are you studying ah, the sinkholes cool. here? I'm trying to figure out what causes them. Any luck? My scans show a high concentration of calcium carbonate deep below us, mm. high enough to create pockets that of would brittle rock. erode easily. These pockets break down and That's collapse, limestone. and it causes a chain reaction all the way to the surface. Incidentally, that would also account for all this sand. Well, why were you in the sinkhole? Like, were you actually in the sinkhole? Pathfinder, or... I detect a dip in temperature ahead. The scavengers have set a dune camp. What's a dune camp? Oh, of course I put it all the way over there. I said, hey, I can at least get you to the Tempest. You know, you can hang out on the Tempest for a bit if you want, maybe. And she's like, no, I'll try not to die of exposure here. I'm like, you... <laughs> okay, whatever. If you die, it's your fault. I gave you an option. Saw some of your scouts. Dead, probably. Otherwise, you wouldn't have. Huh? Saw some of your scouts where? Or what? I don't understand. Where's the waypoint I just put down? Oh. You know the drill? Let's get those cores. No, it's not. Ooh, is that like a sandstorm? Ooh, are we in a sandstorm right now? Station deployment. In a little bit of a sandstorm. That's cool. Mining zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added them to your Yay. nav system. Yeah, isn't Elodin 100%? But apparently, we still we're still earning Andromeda viability points, I guess. With everything that we do. Let's go mess with the outlaw's tech. Or not. Oh wow, big sinkhole. You still owe me a seismometer. I'm not the brainiac who left it lying around. <laughs> no, you're the big-footed clod who tripped over it. Thought you were good at fixing things. And then landed your ass on it. Crushed it flat. Uh -huh. So you admit defeat. Oh, nice. That was funny. Is 
here? Damn it. Abandoned. They scuttled everything. Well, we're here. Might as well search it. Might as well. Probably a trap somewhere. Oh. Is that Pock right there? Ryder, he's got Pock. She's broken, though. Guess Kalinda didn't take very good care of her. Hey, I don't want any trouble. I found this site abandoned. By scavenger law, it's all mine. There's no such thing as scavenger yeah, law. all right. You made that up. Um, scavenger law? Scavengers get to make up the laws? No, then you could just make up new ones. <clears throat> Well, I'm a businessman, you see, so I'm willing to sell if you see anything you like. Did you see where the crew that used the site went? No. They were trouble, though. Led by a pain in the ass Asari with a mean as spit Krogan toady. They've been picking remnant sites clean all over. Never leave anything worthwhile behind. But, uh, they screwed up and left some choice items here, though. Mm-hmm. You ever hear of an Asari named Kalinda Terev? That's the, uh, pain in the ass Asari I stupidly mentioned. <sighs> Please don't tell her I called her that, or next time I see her, it's my ass. Yeah? So you better do right by us. How much mm -hmm. for that broken observer? What, this thing? Yeah, it may look trash, but I assure you, it's easy to fix right up. In fact, I could do it myself and make a killing, so uh, no discounts. Right. This guy's gonna put her back together. Let's get down to business. Okay, look, what do you think is fair for the observer? Take this, and consider yourself lucky. Yep, that'll do. Pleasure doing ah. business with you. I'll get her to the Tempest and put her together. Thank you, Ryder. Maybe this Kalinda nightmare is over. Don't start going naive on me, PB. <sighs> yeah. Regardless, Meh. I can upgrade my remnant scanner now. Come see me back at the ship. Pleasure yeah, doing we business did it. with you. Mm, indeed. Just gonna take all your stuff. Speak to PB on the Tempest. Oh my gosh. Played for almost three and a half hours. PB said she wanted to talk to you. Indeed. There you are. Hi. Uh, hi. Uh, yeah, uh... Okay, who stole PB and put you in her clothes? Not funny. It's a little funny. Okay. A little funny? It's a little funny. I received it. <laughs> hey, babe. Sorry I broke your pet. It lacked versatility. Couldn't keep up. Maybe I'll do the same with your other new toy. Ta. She means you. I hate her. Really? Are you sure about that? Oh, I don't know. It's not that she took my bot and broke her. We got Pock back and I repaired her. Better than ever. Now my scanner's fully upgraded and sweeping the cluster for remnant signals. We won. So what's the problem? It's just... Drummed up feelings I thought I'd put behind me. Turns out I just buried them. This is what happens when you let people in. You acquire baggage. I travel light, damn it. No baggage. You just have to let the right people in. Right can turn wrong. Good goes bad. I let Kalinda become important to me. Look where that ended up. Now you've become, or you're becoming, important. But you need to know, I resist checking out of this hotel every day. I need to know I can count on you. I know. I get it. I just need a little space. Time to think. Hopefully, my now Remtech-infused scanner will pick up something amazing and make all this Kalinda trouble <laughs> Amazing. I like her gestures. Ryder. Hey. I'm so glad we got Pock back. It's weird, but I missed her. You built her. There's investment in that. I can see why you'd miss her. Hmm. Now I 
typical M.O., but maybe that's it. She's so like the coolest thing you've ever made. Thanks for chatting. You know? We'll talk again later. You know it. I haven't done anything with Gil in ages, either. Like, doesn't he have more stuff? I don't know. Maybe I just need to go talk to him, but... I don't know. But I'm gonna go ahead and go for now. I got a couple things to do before I head out tonight. So, thank you all for watching. Hopefully, I'll be able to get these together and put them out while I'm at the hotel. And, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I know it's been a while, but I appreciate it a lot. And uh, I hope to see you in the next one.